There's only one VIR. It's a beautiful part of the country, natural terrain track, so it's truly a special place where it's really a driver's track. We bring about 400,000 people here a year, and they come with wide eyes, leave with big smiles, and I love it. I love coming down here so much that I drive eight and a half hours from Columbus, Ohio every year. VR is definitely by far my favorite course on the entire East Coast. If you want to drive a track that's truly an international track, that's similar to the tracks that you'll find in Europe and other places in the world, VIR is, is the place to come. And it's a track that when you see it on the schedule, everybody marks that date because they want to go to VIR and they, they want to race there. And that to me is what makes a great race track. VIR is my favorite race track. I describe VIR as being three frighteningly fast sections separated by three incredibly technical sections. And to me, it's really what road racing is about. Some hills, left and right turns, a mixture of driving skills are needed for it. It's just amazing to have a room that you can walk outside on your own balcony, and the straightaway is right there. When you look at the uniqueness of VIR, it has so much character. and it, it has the twists, it has the turns, it has the straightaways. People defy the laws of physics on a daily basis. People just don't understand what the, the violent conditions these guys are going through in the cockpit. It's, you know, I want people to really consider VIR not as a club track or a scenic photographic club track. I want them to see it as a scenic photographic racing track and a real racing track and one that people are extremely serious about when they come here. They say, these guys are racers. They get it. VIR is one of, one of my favorites. Uh, it's just got so many technical corners. It's got the roller coaster in the back fast straights, uh, some, some corners that make you pucker up just a little bit and, you know, power on through. One of the most challenging bits of racetrack anywhere in North America. VIR has a very special place in my heart. It's kind of like coming home to me here. <laughs> What's not to love about it? Look at the weather. It's beautiful. It was always a really good technical track. Lots of high speed, lots of good technical corners. I wouldn't want to race anywhere else if I could. <laughs> Now you've had a chance to drive VIR, what do you think? I have to say, uh, it's my favorite track so far here in America. Um, I like it, and I love it to drive it. This kind of track is very fit for our car. Busy coming, looks like the lead, he takes Hensler. Left handed coming up, he got him. What a move, can he hang on here for the last one? He comes up, Hensler comes up. Red John Carlo Fisichella win GTLM. VR was built back in 57 and operated till 74. Three Eds found the property and approached the Foot family about building VIR on the Foot family South Bend farm. When Harvey Siegel and I came here in May of 98, we set to work putting together our master plan, getting all of our permits in place, and we started construction and opened 22 months later. VIR is much more than a racetrack. Our bread and butter business is renting to others, and we bring in all kinds of groups from all over the country, even internationally. We do pro racing, we do corporate groups, we have a um, growing industrial park where the Errol Adam is produced, and Virginia Tech Transportation Institute has two labs. We have all kinds of resort activities, skeet, rifle and pistol shooting, two hotels, residential villas, a small spa, cart track. I mean, if, if it's got wheels, we've got a home for it, and if you want to have some other fun around it, we can do that too. And then, of course, we all top it off at Connie's Pub and Oak Tree Tavern, our restored 1840s plantation home. And the food is really good. It's 
So we're almost like a resort built around race courses instead of a racetrack with amenities. It's a place that you can do all kinds of unique activities in a really fabulous laid back environment. Come casual with good shoes and ready to be active. VIR is a multiple option facility. You can eat here, you can sleep here, you can shoot guns here, you can go kart here, you can run on a racetrack here, you can have your equipment dynoed here, you can have your tires tested here, you can go on a simulator, uh, you know, you can have a full service spa here. It's just amazing all the different things that you can do on a regular basis at VIR. You know, people come here just to camp to enjoy being outside. When they roll through the gates here, it's almost like somebody took a state park and put a racetrack in it. When they start driving around, they get struck by the beauty and you almost don't even see a racetrack. People find themselves relaxing and uh, just getting in touch with things they may not notice before. That, you know, like, oh gosh, the sunsets are so beautiful here. The sunrise is so beautiful. The fog, um, the way the leaves are changing, um, the way the storm is rolling in, it just looks so amazing. It really is, it's almost like rose-colored glasses at VIR because everything just looks, I don't know, just more enhanced, more beautiful. We got here and I'm reading the brochure and I said, hey, we can shoot skeet. There's a spa. I could, we could come here and do like uh, several days and not leave this place. They stay here, they eat here. Once they get here, we keep them captive and engaged and I've never seen one leave unhappy. <laughs> Thank you.